Here are your morning headlines for Wednesday, April 15. Moyes predicts quick turnaround when football returns West Ham boss David Moyes has revealed he does not expect to have any more than three weeks to work with his players before the season resumes. The Premier League remains hopeful that games could restart behind closed doors in June. That is contingent on the government's guidelines being committed to finishing the current season. Regardless, there are concerns about the fitness of players, who have been limited to exercising outside their homes once a day. There are also further concerns about how the Premier League will facilitate next season, with time in short supply. I think that four weeks would be ideal, Moyes told BN Sports his Keys and Grey show, available on YouTube. I think three weeks will be the maximum we get. Video loading video unavailable click to play tap to play the video will start in 8 cancel I don't see it being like a close season where players have a good holiday for 3 or 4 weeks, I think the players will have kept themselves in better condition so I would hope that we could start a bit quicker. Everybody's now talking about the injuries we are liable to pick up either during the three-week preparation time or during the period where it looks like we'll have to play an awful lot of games in a short period of time. Read more related articles Read more related articles Forest Star addresses transfer links to West Ham Matty Cash addressed the transfer interest linking him with a move away from Nottingham Forest yesterday. The right-back was reportedly courting interest from Italian giant AC Milan as well as Premier League side West Ham United. Cash, who admitted his agent had spoken to him about the January interest has enjoyed an excellent season under Sabre Lamochi. Cash said, my agent had a few chats with me. There were a few conversations but I had a job to do at the time and a few games to focus on, but I heard about it, yeah. The latest from West Ham This is your roundup of all things West Ham United, the one-stop shop that will keep you updated on the latest goings on at the London Stadium, and beyond. Transfers, injuries, match days and managers, we've got you covered. We'll be bringing the very latest on the irons throughout week and around the clock. Make sure you keep yourself updated with our handy daily catch-up. Must reads injury latest as Pellegrini faces fresh concerns, read let's talk about Lanzini, a help or a problem. Read what Pellegrini admitted in his Chelsea press conference, read why Antonio wasn't involved at Stamford Bridge, read, for all your latest West Ham United news, opinion, analysis and transfer gossip, click here West Ham and Wolves battle for forward West Ham and Wolves have entered the race to sign Werder Bremen winger Milot Rashica, according to Der Spiegel. The summer transfer window promises to be a busy time for clubs as they frantically try to adjust to the impact of the coronavirus epidemic. Werder Bremen are currently mired in the relegation zone in the Bundesliga. If they were required to sell any of their stars, they would likely have to do so in a much shorter time frame. Milo Trashikov celebrates scoring for Werder Bremen. Image Photo by Adam Pretty slash Bongets slash Kitty Images, both Wolves and West Ham have reportedly identified a potential bargain signing in Rashica. If Bremen fail to escape from the drop zone Rashica's £33 million release clause will drop to £17 million, according to Visa Courier. The former Vitesse winger has previously been linked with Liverpool, Aston Villa and Southampton, with Borussia Dortmund also credited with an interest. This comes after his agent likened him to former Bayern star Frank Ribéry. I would compare him to Ribéry, great change of pace, great dribbling, he can quickly start from the left and move to the right, Neck Capric told Gonfalerit. He is 23 years old, and he is already very intelligent, he is doing well on the pitch. Let's block ads. Why?